Kurgan cannot poke and disengage. If I'm Thrall, that's kind of okay as well. Chain Lightning, Chain Lightning, Wind Fury away. Shit hits the fan, boom, Sundering. So, yes, I made mechanical mistakes, but the opponent was also very good. And our draft didn't work well together. The same thing is like, if I'm Arthas Kerrigan and we want to hard engage, we don't need a Lunara behind us. We need a Jaina behind us or something like it. <clears throat> and Tyrael could really help there. Kerrigan can poke with W. Yeah, we can... <laughs> <coughs> Dark Omicron on the other team. Kirby, does your chat work when you're offline so we can watch your hero builds? Yes, feel free to come in and poll for my hero builds, uh, Uxesu. I do update them pretty regularly. <coughs> Anyone can join the Asus ROG channel, uh, What Doth Life. It's a pretty cool place to just hang out and find people to play with. Let's fly! I thank you. I'm okay with it. Okay with what? Um, let's see. Dragon Shire. I can play any of these. They are false start. I can go Chromie, Kerrigan, Mouth, Stitches, Tyrael, Vala, Toronda, and. Wait till they get alone. Okay, he's Kerrigan. Then maybe I should go Tyrael. Or Chromie. Tyrael, Tyrael, where's Tyrael? Where's Tyrael? Here we go again. Okay, there we go. I need to try and hit my spells on Kerrigan's combos. Kirby, what do you think about Smurf account? Well... I have made many Smurf accounts in Warcraft 3 and Starcraft 2, so I'm pretty supportive of Smurf accounts. And also, I believe in setting rules that are enforceable. And of course, if it's not enforceable, the rules should at least follow moralistic principles. Whether or not smurfing is moralistic is actually a point of debate. I think it's not nice to do it too much because you're basically defeating newbie players with superior skills. But there are some mitigating factors. I think And it's you. also not enforceable Dear to Professor stop it. Professor Grubby. So, I don't know. Can you share with us who you think are the three supports with most playmaking ability? I would love to, Tribal Hots. Thank you for your seven Daras. Uh, so here's the supports. The most playmaking potential from all of these... Ooh. It's really hard to say. It's not Mouth. It's not Morales. It's not Lily. Brightwing can do loads. Karazim can do loads. Oreo can do loads. So can Taranda. I think Rhaegar can, but he's not the very mostest playmakerist. I'm making a hot list here. Like Uther. Uther also doesn't fall. Like, yeah, you can divine shield with someone, but it's not as much the playmaking as enabling a playmaker. So I would say Ariel, Taronda, and Karazim. Or Brightwing. Okay, let's. Can I, can, I, can I say four tribal hots? Ariel, Taronda, Brightwing, and Karazim. Why those four? <clears throat> Ariel has a blind or a displacement. She has a stasis on someone else. 
and she has a 1.5 second stun. She's a pretty high skill hero, but extremely powerful. She can kill people almost by herself when they're a bit hurt already. Taronda, skill shot stun, uh, vision all the time with Sentinel, a finisher with Sentinel, and she's difficult to play. Then you've got Brightwing, she can zip around the map. Yeah, Tassadar is really good too, by the way. Zip around the map, polymorph targets, finish people off with skill shot cues. Tassadar, force wall. Tassadar almost plays like a surrogate tank. Very aggressive, then use your E and get out. Karazim, he can finish people with a few punches. Divine Palm at the very last second. Escape death by using your cues. Alright, what do we got here? Uh, we have an all-in team. Double melee assassin with a uh, group divine shield on Tyrael and an uh, aggressive support Rhaegar. This is very strong. We're against double tank, which is a smart choice by them. And uh, they have disengage with Falstad. And then we have me. And I follow up on whatever damage, on whatever stun Kerrigan initiates, ideally. Actually. On the one hand, Chromie has poke, but she also has burst. So it's not entirely that Chromie is a poor follow-up on Kerrigan. I just don't have a lot of uh, occupation on the shrines. War is I need to kill them first. I hope you're ready. Most assuredly, but you... well... <laughs> Be careful, okay? <laughs> okay. Uh, which one do we go for? Battle commencing in ten seconds. Oh wow, you get ability power at the end. That's pretty cool. Five, um, four, three, two, one. Unleash yes! the oh, that's right. Yeah! <laughs> I think I'll go for the burst, or shall I go sustained? Maybe I should go for the sustained. Yeah, I'll get uh, compounding either, sustained damage. Burst is not as good on warrior teams. What worries me, well, a little bit, is that we don't have anyone to... Uh, besides Thrall, we have no giant killers. There was a number of people away, man. <laughs> yes. no, that's right. Oh, the triple man's done. Wow, Kerrigan. Yeah, I need to not hook if he's. I need to not uh, cue into stitches if he still has hook. I knew that was gonna happen. I can see into the future. I'll go for piercing sands. Uh oh, oh, they got it. Oops. Mistakes were made a little bit. If I knew that, I was going to go to the middle. <laughs> no worries. Should I go top there? So much left to be done. Ping ping. Love that sound.
Pipping. We have all the time in the world. Pipping. Fudge, too much juking actually. And uh, Li Ming carefully delayed her spells. Can you explain what talent and why you take it on level 12, Chromie? Yeah, I'm gonna take the range, I think. Just so I can stay out of trouble. Now, here I'm gonna get Chrono Sickness. I juke too much. I need to kind of. Um, be patient with stacking my Q, not too greedy. Put my traps smartly. So much left to be done. I kind of need to aim my spell as she's about to hit her combo. Uh, did you buy most of your skins? How do you have so many? Yeah, I spent money. I spent money on buying the skins. Definitely. There's a lot of good ones. I gotta have them. So much left to be done. We have 16 stacks and we need 9 more. I'll try to poke them off of this. You know, if they try to take it. Pretty strong slowing sounds. I'll try to take bottom. Slowing sounds is actually stupidly OP right now. Slowing sound stays when I go into the Dragon Knight. Oh, it doesn't stay. That would be so OP. <laughs> that would be so OP. No gust away. Ah, uh, we got 26 seconds left. I don't know what I'm doing here. Yeah, I should go from this side. I got 15 seconds left. Uh, careful throw up there. We don't know who is up there. Eight seconds and less HP. Okay, this is where I get the uh, range. Okay. 
so good slowing sense. <laughs> So sick. <laughs> yeah, lol. Uh -huh. Turns out it is. This is so sick. Of course, I am out of mana now. Take down that hero now. In what case do you take the other talents at level 12? Uh, almost never. Um, I do like Bye Bye, but I think Bye Bye is kind of like a... Um, bye Bye is a little bit like a split push talent. Go deep in a lane and then Hearthstone out. But then why would you ever go deep in a lane with Chromie? I do think it's the weaker one. Uh, ice block can be good, but it's against hard engage. No, 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 no. Wow. So sick, Ancestral. He wants to gust. Oh, I just chunked the living. I, I got him with the Q. Such a sick heal. <laughs> nice bait. <laughs> Always white flash. The power of the bronze dragonflight. Um, I go shifting sands. <laughs> I saw it all right. I got him. Oops. I'm going to pull back for now. Yeah, one for one could be better. Oh, that was fun. Uh uh, I need mana. Uh uh, I need mana. I never heard that before.
We're leading, but we're not leading by let's throw on the core overconfidently much. Uh, Fawcett is top. Yeah, I'm a mana addict, I know. Have you ever heard the voice lines from Warcraft 3, FFD? Where Kael'thas is like, going to a mana addict group, and it's like... Or did I dream that? I think there was a scene like that, where if you click the blood mage many times, he's like, I'm a mana addict. I think there is one. Any chance you're gonna play Tassadar tonight? Uh, I don't... I don't... No, no, no. No chance. Uh, no, sorry. You didn't dream that? It's there? Okay. I just... Uh, I, I just forgot exactly how it went to. I guess you can look it up. Like, Blood Mage voice lines, Warcraft 3. And it basically, it's like an AA meeting, but it's about how he's a mana addict. Most important bruiser camp ever. Yeah, man. Sometimes, you just gotta give it your all, apparently. I don't remember Dragon's Breath insta-killing a wave. Oh, it's because I always take one of the other W talents. With Mobius it doesn't, with dragons it does. I thought it was because of dragons. This way again? Or is this the first one? Casual thousand damage. I don't mind playing it safe, it's pretty okay. Does slowing sands proc spell shield? Nope, only damage does. Yes. Oh, that's right. Farming twenty is fine. Wait, I'm 19. Um, increase the slow? Yeah, I'll get the slow. This slow things down. Let's get moving. Remove mana cost and increase slow. There was a lot of damage there. This way again? Or is this the first time? The time is in the local door itself. Who's next? I'm done my rules. Nice. I can slow them down. If we want Muradin, we can have him. One kill is enough to secure the DK anyway. Oh, he's heartstoning. Here. I'll just take it. Seems good. Uh, I think we can go for the core probably with these levels. Kind of depends how everything goes. It's what we'll try. Maybe I'd kick away the support. Again. Kick away Merlin.
Get support. Bomb is down. Okay, just get the keep. Have a lot of zoning. Oh, you know what? I wanted Underhaul Anomaly. I forgot that I took this level 7. But I think it's kind of okay. Because you're going to get lots of traps, but it's not per se better. It's very safe for yourself, but it doesn't necessarily encourage good teamwork. I feel like we should be pushing now. I feel like it's a mistake. We're giving them level 20. Yeah, you should probably never push into the death bridge. That's a pretty good point, the Titan KOS. <laughs> Gorge Bolt. Ah, the cheese. Gotcha. Nice uh, sanctification. And that was that. Ah, oh, Stitches keeps getting punished. This fort must be destroyed. That keep is no more. Yes. <laughs> gotcha. We had to do it, you know. Never let anybody go. Oh, bam. Nice. Nice, we did it. Yeah, I'll just tank the core with my time traps. Thank you for the ancestral. Nice aim bolts for Kerrigan combos, yeah. <laughs> he plays a pretty good Kerrigan, Yellow Flash. Man, uh, will you be playing some Tassadar tonight? No Necrocake, no Tassadar. Uh, I'm doing free to play, which is all 2000 gold heroes and each one on the free rotation. I'm top feed, but top damage. I can accept that. Your team's awareness of Gorge Bolt was insane. Everyone rushed to help them with Sanct, Cleanse and stuff. Super nice teamwork, yeah. Yeah, this was one of those magical teams again. Even the warning and stuff. Like, careful, Gorge Bolt. People check talents, people warn each other, people plan to act. Uh, my talents was QQ, uh, more ease, the slow after the E, slowing sands with pockets of time. And I think I could have chosen a different one there. You'll find that 60% is already pretty, pretty damn good. Hold on, I see a mosquito. Uh, I missed, but um, I could have gone Underhaul Anomaly or Past and Future Me. I think maybe that one would be pretty good. 
Uh, and then reaching through time. Bonus range. Is Medivh still your most fun hero? Uh, not in a while already. I guess. I like to take three traps, but only when they have died. Yeah, exactly. I love the synergy of 719, but I really didn't need it. Could have gone Q boost though. So, so much meat loss? Not really, you only lose five at the moment. It's very forgiving to die as Butcher with Abattoir. Oh, that spell shield really saved me. 